transfer to fluoride, but what exactly is it and how does it work to prevent cavities? Fluoride is actually found naturally in rocks, soil, and water. It's a chemical ion of the element fluorine, the 13th most abundant element in the Earth's crust. An ion is a positively or negatively charged atom that helps elements combine with each other. Fluoride is a negatively charged ion that doesn't normally exist by itself. Instead, it combines with positively charged ions like sodium to make some of the ingredients that are found in your toothpaste. When these fluoride compounds are in your mouth, they can actually make your teeth stronger and prevent cavities. Fluoride is in most community water systems as well as some mouth rinses, and your dentist can apply it to your teeth in the dental office too. No matter what the source is, fluoride does the same thing to help prevent cavities. It can even reverse early tooth decay. Here's the science behind how fluoride works to fight cavities. Tooth enamel, the outer covering of your teeth that's stronger than bone, is made up of a compound called hydroxyapatite. The main minerals in hydroxyapatite are calcium and phosphate. Your spit or saliva is loaded with calcium and phosphate and bathes the teeth to keep them strong. But each time you eat carbohydrates like candy or noodles, bacteria in your mouth also eat and produce acids that attack the enamel. In this process, calcium and phosphate minerals are lost from the tooth enamel. That's demineralization, making it more likely to decay and form cavities. Fortunately, another process is also happening. Once the acid attack slows down, the calcium and the phosphate and the saliva go back into the enamel in a process called remineralization. It's a constant seesaw battle. Cavities start when there's more demineralization than remineralization. Fluoride is very important in this battle. When fluoride is in your mouth, it actually gets into the enamel through the remineralization process and forms a new super cavity fighting compound called fluoroapatite. Fluoroapatite is much stronger and resists decay much better than hydroxyapatite. So now that you know the science inside your mouth, be sure to brush your teeth twice a day with a fluoride toothpaste that has the ADA seal of acceptance and drink water with fluoride in it too. If you have any questions about your fluoride needs, be sure to ask your dentist. For the ADA Science Inside, I'm Dr. Jane Gillette.